Miracles from Heaven is out today. And it's a movie that we all need to experience with our families. And it's all based on a real life story. Jennifer Garner plays the character in the movie, but you know, Christy, you're a star now. What's it like having a movie about you and your family? It's crazy. <laughs> it's crazy, but it's it's a wonderful crazy and I'm so so honored and so grateful. And there's certainly a lot to celebrate in this movie, right? Oh my goodness, there's so much to celebrate. A lot of um, trials and struggles and agony, but a lot to celebrate. And what does this mean, Christy, to you and your family knowing that the DVD is launching today? Oh, you know, it's just, um, I feel like a a culmination of, of everything coming full circle. Um, I love the fact that people can have movie night as a family. They can sit around and watch it and have popcorn and um, that it'll become part of the family um, in their home. I mean, I know a lot of people went to the theaters, uh, but um, it'll be more intimate, I feel like, in their own home. And it's going to resonate with so many people it already has. Well, you lived it, and now we get to watch it. And the thing I love about uh, featurettes like this on DVD is they provide interviews with the uh, original family, and you have such a great camera presence. Have you always had that? Um, I don't know. I guess so. Um, it was so fun to get to do the 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 questions where they would ask, and um, we would in the bonus feature where Annabelle and I got to kind of be just us and. And people, I feel like, get an opportunity to see a snapshot of how we really are together because we have kind of a, a different relationship because we have been through so much together. I think people are really going to enjoy seeing that. And when did you know, Christy, this could actually happen? Like, I mean, like it would literally be made into a movie. Well, I feel like it, you know, it's the fastest book to screen in cinema history. So while we were working on the manuscript and getting it prepared for publishing, I spoke with Devon Franklin. And um, after he and I finished that phone call, I, I knew, okay, this, God has big plans for this because he was so excited and so big and full of life, but his heart still mirrored mine and the desire, what I wanted to see play out for people was so similar with his. And so I think I knew then, okay, this is gonna be really great. Well, it certainly is. But let's turn our attention to Jennifer Gardner, one of my favorite actresses. She uh, received critical acclaim for this role. What impressed you most about how she immersed herself in learning your life? You know, she and I met and had several meetings, but the very first one we had, we connected right away. Um, I think we connected as moms, but then we just connected all different levels and, I mean, to talking about what we we're going to cook for dinner and how we're both sick of cooking chicken. I mean, you know, it was just we really quickly bonded and and she didn't just do the role. She truly owned the role and she wanted to understand what it was like and she mastered so many things about me, my my cadence of speech and my mannerisms. I mean, she just brilliant. Well, I certainly know that people will love her performance and uh, it's so great just having a chance to meet you and Christy and your inspiration. You've had a strong faith your whole life. Uh, where did that come from? I would definitely say being raised in a Christian home. Um, you know, ever since I can remember, it's always been about him. We've always been, we were always raised in church. You know, when the doors were open, we were there. Um, raised church camps and just, you know, knowing that when things get um, difficult that you can go to the Word and it's always the same and that God is the same God, you know, today as He was years ago as He will be tomorrow. And just that, that sturdy foundation, I think, is what gave me my strength. Well, Christy, you certainly are strong and a true inspiration. But when dark times hit a family, as you know, many people don't step to the Lord, they step away from the Lord. So what's the lesson to learn from your family? Um, I feel like it's got to be that you surround your people, you surround yourself with people who are also grounded in faith. So whenever you begin to struggle and you begin to ask questions and you begin to wonder where are you God and can I see you God, um, you surround yourself with people who can affirm for you, yes you do see Him and you see Him in all these ways and they pray with you and they pray for you 
because I know our congregation, the church that we're involved with, Allsbury Baptist, if it wasn't for so many of the people there, it would have been truly, truly difficult to get through what we went through. Well, Christy, thank you for sharing those words, but the centerpiece of the movie is about your daughter. Can you give us an update with her today? Oh, she's amazing. She's healthy and happy and thriving and um, I like to say that God didn't just heal her um, physically, but emotionally and mentally and um, academically. She's thriving and successful in school. She's happy and silly and fun. Well, let's take a step back. What was it like watching the film in the cinema, the big silver screen for the first time? You know, they rented out a theater and, uh, well, rented out a, a place to show it to us in one of the small theaters in the big cinema house, um, whatever that's called. And um, we were able to um, just sit there as a family. It was just the five of us and a couple of people from Sony were there. And um, we all just sat together and I was nervous and Kevin was a little nervous and Abby was a little nervous. And um, Annabelle, she was so great. You know, I'm crying and Kevin's crying. Annabelle sat with her legs crisscrossed with a big bucket of popcorn in her lap just shoving in popcorn and drinking her huge drink and laughing and I said I said Annabelle you didn't cry at all and she said no and I said it wasn't hard to watch you be in that pain again and she said yeah but I already knew it was a happy ending why would I get upset <laughs> I thought well you've got it figured out because I cried like a baby <laughs> well, all I can say is that I was crying and I was just watching the trailer so I can tell you it's a touching, inspiring, must-watch movie. But Christy, when a health problem uh, or adversity faces families, the percentage of marriages that end in mm -hmm. divorce is alarming. I'm sure you're aware of that. But what can we learn from your marriage that solidified it and came out so strong? Um, you know, one thing that Kevin and I adopted early on whenever Annabelle was diagnosed and we were told that the statistics for marriage with children with illness is extremely high for divorce was um, Kevin made the statement that there was no there was no question of anything happening to our marriage divorce was never ever an option it was never ever a possibility and he said you can run to the ends of the earth but I will follow you and bring you back and so it just, in that solid foundation, knowing that we were in it thick and thin together, I think you have to have that. Well, I'm certainly glad you live it. You're a true inspiration. And of course, I salute Kevin for finding you, a magical marriage that's an inspiration to so many of us. But before we go, I know that you speak at churches all over the world. What message are you sharing with people? You know, the greatest message I feel like I've learned from this that I share with others is to look up. And I tell people just look up because whenever we were going through our struggles and trials, I put one foot in front of the other. I just got through it. But whenever I was writing the book and working on the manuscript and, and reflecting through the movie, I looked back and I saw all those small miracles that were going on around me daily that I missed during the time when I needed to see them most. And so my message to people is don't miss the miracles when you need to see them. Look up. Well, I'm certainly glad you looked up. We're so glad that Annabelle is doing so well that you made time for us today. And we salute you and your family for being an inspiration and sharing your story through this new movie on DVD available today. Thank you so much, Christy, and blessings to you and your family. Thank you so much for having me.